John Hayes will make his final Munster appearance against Connacht on St Stephen's Day. The man known as the Bull has won all bar the World Cup at representative level for club and country. And today Munster trained at Brough, the county Limerick club, where his career began. Every great must call it a day sometime. But the huge crowds that gathered in Brough for the final Munster training session of the great John Hayes today was testament to the Limerick man's standing in the game. He's been a great servant to the game, great servant to the local area as well too and everybody's very proud of him. Hopefully he will come down and do a small bit of coaching. Being such a quiet man I can't see him doing it but maybe he will, you know. Oh, I, watch I, love, I love watching it. I just wanted that now than a football match. <laughs> The Bull has never enjoyed the limelight, but back where it all started, the 38-year-old prop was willing to give some insight on the end of a wonderful playing career. I suppose there's a bit of, small bit of uh, sadness there, like, you know, that it's coming to an end, like, but it's a realisation too that it had to happen, that the time had come and, uh, and fully accepted it over the last few months. With 105 Ireland caps and 211 Munster appearances before Monday's swan song with Connacht, Hayes has no regrets. But he will miss certain aspects of his professional life. Days like in uh, Thomas Park in Lansdowne Road uh, will definitely be missed and definitely the crack around the team room and meeting up with all the lads every every day. And that's probably the best thing you can say about Hayes. He would, when, when he retires, is you know he's, he'll always be a friend to the fellas he played with, he, even though he won't answer his phone. But that's beside the point. I, I saw you taking off the boots. You're walking around in, in your socks now. Are the boots off for the final time, or could you be coerced into turning up at Brough the odd weekend? No, they're off for the final time on on, uh, on Stephen's Day. That's it. There's no more uh, no more appearances. I really enjoy this and uh, it's kind of just time to move on now and start a new chapter. Well, John Hayes has certainly graced the finest rugby stadia in the world with some aplomb, but fitting that for his monster swan song he should return to his native brough. John B. Keane's line, "'Tis your field bull, was perhaps never more fitting. Joe Stack, RT News, with the Monster Rugby Squad.